I'm Jayanti Kumaresh. Talking about the origins of veena, any string instrument is called a veena. Vaniyante iti veena. So when you really look back at history and find out what was the first veena that man made, he made it using a human skull with a bamboo stick stuck on it and a gut, a nerve used as a string. So. Um, a skull with a bamboo stick and a gut on top of it. And the first mention of the Veena we find in the Vedas during the Vedic times. But before that I am talking about when man was hunting the caveman. When he had the bow and he heard the twang of the string from the bow. That was the first twang he probably heard and then he went on to uh, fix one more string on the bow and then one more and then one more and he got what looks like a harp. The minute he wanted to play on the pitch, on the tone of the notes he got from this bow, he fixed a tuning peg so that he could get the exact pitch he wanted, the high pitch or low pitch. And that's when from the zither family, all these harps and all these things are called zithers. From there we moved to the lute family when we got the tuning pegs. And then came the fitting of the frets and then came the resonator. So the in the bow, I think the front wooden thing was the resonator. And he realized the bigger the resonator, more the sound. And he started experimenting with oval resonators, square resonators, you know, cylindrical resonators and then we found development and the Saraswati Veena that you see now is the outcome of um, what happened 350 years ago during the reign of King Raghunath Nayak and that's when the 24 fret 7 string instrument was created.